Good afternoon, welcome back to Lynch TV. Me, Sam Phillips, and I'm joined by Runcorn Lynch, manager Dave Wilde. Dave, thanks for joining us. Uh, a very wet conditions here at the uh, Leeson.com stadium and a 3-2 defeat, but a last-minute penalty. You, how would you take that? I don't know what to say, mate. I, um, me, personally, I don't think it was a penalty. Um, the liner on our side, who's obviously lucky, he's 50, 60 yards away, he doesn't think it's a penalty. He won't admit that in the room. I've just gone over to the ref at the end and the ref's told me, yeah, we'll speak inside. That tells me that he's got something to say. So, yeah, it's a bit good, really. But I don't think it was a foul for the free kick that led to the save that led to the penalty. Um, but I just feel a little bit, I just feel sorry for the lads, really. I, it's a strange, it's the strangest feeling I've felt. I feel gutted for losing, but proud of the performance. I'm proud of our club as a whole today because that end was outrageous, like, outrageously good from minute one to minute 95. And I think all the idiocy and shenanigans that have gone on on Twitter over the last like four to six days have sort of proven how good a club we actually are and same to Macclesfield so um, <laughs> yeah just yeah, we, we spoke on Thursday uh, away from, from camera and we were talking about what was the game plan going to be and you could see a, a very solid game plan in the first half to just sort of see it out obviously Dan Sweeney got the goal but second half we were electric yeah, look, I, I told the lads at the start of the game that Dan's a, a real threat. When I was at Matlock, he, he, he came in and trained with us and he was someone that we wanted to get over the line and just couldn't because of, because of travel and you see he's threatening the box. Um, yeah, we were good in the second half. Um, I'm just a bit, just a bit thinking for words. I thought Cam, Ro Cam Rooney was brilliant again, um, as we've just come to expect now. Um, I just think to a man, I can't, I can't single anyone out. I just think to a man, we were we were really good today. And, and the bit, the thing that I'm most proud of for the lads is that Robbie Savage has come on the pitch. The managers have said it. McElroy said it. Uh, board members have said it. Uh, that we're the best team that's been here all season. And we didn't deserve it. So I can, you know, you can take a little bit of um, comfort from that. Um, I think that the results gone our way in, yeah. in terms of the playoff. Yeah. So I just, uh, I just hope that it's not we don't miss out by a point because we didn't deserve that. Yeah, Sorry no, we, to be so deflated, but... <laughs> it's understandable yeah, after yeah. that. Um, now we move on to, to Tuesday. First semi-final yep. of the two uh, against Bootle. How do we sort of put the adulation slash disappointment of this game behind us for that one? It's a semi-final. We'll be all right. We'll be ready for it. Listen, at the end of the day, Mac, Mac are the, comfortably the best team in the league for me, followed by Workington. Um, and we just toe-to-toe -to -toe with them for 90 minutes. We beat them in the cup and beat them in the league, so... Um, we're, we're in good fair. Listen, it's a semi final. We, nobody needs more for that. We'll be going to win. Perfect. Well, thanks so for joining us, Dave. We will win. Think we'll be going with the aim to win <laughs> for anything. I'm being arrogant. <laughs> Perfect. Well, we'll speak to you on Tuesday. Thanks a lot. Cheers, mate.